Right. Well, I just okay. want to ask you have her, to have the, that. It, depending on how you're defining it, because some people kind of use that as a broad sweep. Let's define it as the weapon of mass destruction. Well. How about new? Oh, not the spew again. Well, you know, it's kind of crazy because I think of all of the banning of stuff that's going on in this country. Mm -hmm. Banning of books. He's lying. Mm -hmm. Banning of books. Books don't kill people. Banning of trans people. You liar! I don't know any trans people or of any trans people that have killed people. <laughs> Books are being banned to the public. Schools have always been able to pick and choose which books they present to children. That's exactly why you can't find books about intelligent design in schools, because the states voted to remove them. Books about intelligent design never hurt anyone. Books can actually be harmful if they convince boys that they're girls because they like to play with dolls, or teach brown and black kids that they're victims of oppressors who are white, which ends up being used as justification for the racial discrimination and segregation of white people. Which it's probably why you won't find any books by David Duke in the school libraries, you imbecile. Love, love of guns, love of guns. And that's the kind of society we're in. Fucking A. And many of these people don't seem to understand that their actions are causing kids to die. You lying ass bitch. It's going to be solved the day that Republicans realize that they love their children more than they love their guns. Seriously, they're constantly accusing us of being the reason that bad things happen. And somehow, mysteriously, it's always connected to our fundamental rights. Disagreeing with them is hate speech and should be censored to protect people. And now they're going for our other option of recourse against authoritarians. I love my kids and I care about the well-being of kids who aren't mine. That's exactly why I own guns, to protect my kids and other people if need be. We should use guns to protect kids in schools, just like we do our banks and stores. I just love how they never have anybody on that show that can push back against their bullshit. Or somebody might have mentioned the studies done every couple years that show millions of defensive uses of guns that no doubt save the lives of kids. The largest, most comprehensive survey of American gun owners ever conducted suggests that they use firearms in self-defense about one point seven million times a year. It also confirms that AR-15 style rifles and magazines that hold more than 10 rounds, frequent targets of gun control legislation, are in common use for lawful purposes, which the Supreme Court has said is the test for arms covered by the Second Amendment. <laughs> These discussions are, we have to you know, they're going to they're going to keep happening. Get rid of them. But the bottom line is, the bottom line is, this is no discussion. This is a bunch of rich, self-absorbed, uninformed idiots spewing disinformation. If you're going to ban books, if you're going to insist on kids not being given the information about their history, get with it. Why do you think it's okay for you to just have as many guns as you want just cause you wanna? That's not how America works. The fact that these women spew so many lies unchecked on this show is another great example of why we can never, ever let these people define what is and isn't disinformation. The shooting that they're talking about didn't even use an AR-15. He used a handgun, which he obtained illegally. Those strict gun laws, by the way, did nothing because the woke DA let this guy off the hook for past gun crimes. All things that they're obviously never going to mention. Coming from rich, powerful, propaganda mouthpieces who all own guns, live in gated communities, and have armed security. Again, how does taking guns away from law-abiding people solve anything? It doesn't. They just want us all disarmed and silenced so they have no more opposition to their progress. All right, folks, that's all I have for that one. Thanks a lot for watching. If you enjoyed it, please hit that like button, share, subscribe, and make sure to leave a comment to continue the discussion. Thanks a lot again, and I will see you all in the next one.